right guys we got some things to talk about here um so this optimus y'all remember this one from a few weeks ago um i can't remember exactly how how many weeks ago but it has a channel burnout in it and i didn't pay very much for it and let, let's let's come back to that i'm in the process of doubling my um my lithium so what i've had for the last year is 80 amp hours of these cells so two banks and right here sits two more banks and um i've got a really cool amp that came in a few days ago brand new amp off of amazon i paid full price for this thing uh like i do most of my amps that i'm super excited about uh testing and doing a video on but i kind of wanted to get all my lithium hooked up before i did that test that's why i'm not doing an amp dyno this weekend um yeah so a little explanation i've already got the bus bars from uh, jim's machine works so if you if you've watched many videos about fooling with these you're supposed to test them all these are 2.3 volts a piece and they should all come to you at about that voltage and they do they range anywhere from 2.1 to 2.4 something like that and all 24 this is only 12 but in my other two banks they all have tested within there but there's one in here um i've got a some blue painters tape on it that was only 0.4 volts so i've got another cell on the way and that's what has held me up this weekend on uh on putting those together so i've always wanted to go with the excess um just because i wanted number one grade a whatever the best cells you could get i didn't want to fool around and end up with some uh, second rate yin long cell some people have had that kind of trouble and i figure xs is only going to sell the best but like i said it's the only bad one i think it might be this one i can't remember it's got the tape on it but it's on the bottom side but anyhow um like i said i've got another cell on the way to replace that i haven't even put any of them together yet haven't balanced them or anything um <clears throat> but that's what's got me held up on doing an amp dyno this weekend i could have done a dyno with the same setup that i've had but since i had these in it just really had me excited about uh doubling my batteries uh the the video from last week by the way is doing extremely well the one about my son's tahoe uh that was really fun to do that video and uh show you guys what all because that was a lot of work that we put into that thing it sounds so good it's always a treat to take that thing down the road and uh and go listen to it so uh i don't know um stay tuned too because that's uh that tahoe's fixing to get some upgrades um so for you guys that understand please enjoy the rest of this video um for you guys that don't stay tuned till the end because i've got a uh, i've got a treat for you as well so first off i bought this amp on ebay i only gave 15 dollars for this amp i got a really good deal on it and it cost me about 15 and some change to ship it so out of my pocket total i think it was 31 dollars and some change for this amp so for that price it's got a channel burn out of it it's not worth it for me to keep it it's not worth it for me to sell it i don't want to sell it to somebody you know messed up like it is um and it's not worth it to me to fix it to pay to have it fixed so we're gonna have a little fun with it uh what do y'all think that a cup a couple of uh 22 cal 14.3 grain pellets would do to this amp stay tuned let's find out um also i might be pulling your leg a little bit so don't uh don't get too upset with me um i checked on my uh my followers or i'm not sorry i'm sorry subscribers right before i hit the record button on this video and i've got 979 
subscribers. So I've been I've been trying to get to that 1,000 mark for a while. Uh, the channel has grown pretty quick, in my opinion, with the little bit that I do with it. But I've had so much fun over the last year. Actually, it's been a year and two months. I started last June, and uh, now it's August of this year. Uh, but thank y'all so much for the support, and uh, I think I'll probably hit a thousand this week, probably. Like I said, I'm at 979 right now, so I only need 81 more. So. Uh, please consider subscribing. Um, all right, so let's let's put this thing to the test and see what a couple of pellets will do to it. All right, stay tuned for that. Check that out, guys. Those pellets. Holy cow. You can see all the way through that. Those are some stout pellets. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. How about that? All right, guys. Thanks for watching. All right. For anybody who's upset at what they just saw and they can't believe that I would do something like that to an amplifier that powers on and actually works. It don't work properly, but it does power on and work. Guess what? You don't have to be upset any longer. Here it is. It still looks great. It was all a hoax. So you can rest easy tonight. You can sleep good. It was all a trick. Um, yeah, so there you go. There she is. She's still intact, still looks great. All right, thanks for watching.